Hello friends, welcome to another educational video in the field of electricity. In this video, we are going to wire a three-phase electrical panel to start a three-phase electric motor. Please follow me. First, we will introduce the equipment of the electrical panel and then we will go to their wiring. At first, we have a three-phase RCCB switch that protects the electric motor against current leakage and electric shock. This is a single phase miniature switch that is used for single phase output. We also have a three phase monitoring relay that protects the electric motor against two phase and voltage increase and decrease. To turn on and off the electric motor, we need a contactor. We install in its place. And the last device is a current controller or load control relay that protect the electric motor against access currents. Now we go to the input and output terminals. First, we need three phase and one null to enter the electricity into the electrical panel. Now we install the three phase output terminals. This switch board also has a single phase output, so we install phase and null terminals for it. Before we start the wiring, I will show you the wiring diagram in this picture. Please save it so that you can learn and understand it better. At first we connect three phases and null from the input terminals to the input of the RCCB switch. In the second step, we connect the output of the RCCB switch to the input of the contactor. This wiring is related to the power circuit of the electrical panel. In this part, we connect the output of the contactor to the output terminals. But before that, we pass all three wires through the hole of the current controller to calculate the current.
In this part, we connect one phase wire to the input of the miniature switch and connect its output to the single phase output terminal. Also, the single phase output and all protective equipment need a null wire, which we connected to the null output of the RCCB switch. In this part, we have connected the null wire to the phase controller, contactor, and the current controller. To wire the phase controller, we connect three phases from the RCCB switch to the phase input of this device. With this, the device always controls three phases and if one of the phases is interrupted or the voltage increases or decreases, it cuts off the command circuit using relays. Input number 15 is the phase input, so we connect the phases from to it. In this part, we have done the wiring of the command circuit. The electricity comes out of output 18 and is connected to the input of the switch located on the door of the electrical panel.
and its output is connected to the current controller relays and then it's connected to the contactor coil from the output of the con current controller with this when we activate the switch on the door the contactor will be activated and the electric motor will turn on the wiring is finished in this part we close the door of the ducts This video is finished. If you like the video, please press the like and subscribe button. Goodbye.